For the first time, we were able to see inside a school wiped out by a tornado. This is what it looks like where students went to class at Brindley Primary School. And take a look at what it looks like from above. Way 31's storm tracker giving you an idea of how hard that EF2 tornado hit the school. Way 31 Sierra Phillips is live at the Marshall County School where teachers and staff are working to clean it up and move out. Sierra? I spent some time talking to people as they cleaned up here. Overwhelmingly, everyone is heartbroken and just glad no one was hurt. But I'm going to move out of your way so you can look at the damage the tornado left behind. You can see the building is crushed. The roof is partially torn off and school supplies are scattered everywhere. I went past the yellow tape with the school's resource officer to get a closer look. There's steel eye beams that have been pulled out of the pulled out of the ground. They were bolted down to the concrete. Deputy Ken Baker has walked the Brindley Mountain primary halls for almost three years as the school resource officer. Monday, I followed him past the yellow tape to get a look at what his home away from home looks like now after Saturday's EF2 tornado. This is where the kids were, the teachers. Uh, this is where a family was. Just a uh, love and family, really. Now that family is working to save and clean up what they can. Principal Terry Allen says they're keeping a positive attitude. One's uh, griping or complaining, everyone is pulled together and uh, hugging one another and helping one another and loving one another and that's what we do. Staff spent the past 24 hours at the school. It's hard, but the school isn't the building. The school is mainly made by the staff and the kids. A deputy has been stationed here since the tornado happened, and one will be here 24 hours a day for the rest of the week. Reporting live in Marshall County, Sierra Phillips, Way 31 News.